sometimes what inspires me is something happened in my daily life. There is uh, something like outside the street, there is really a very beautiful flower. What if the flower has life? What if there is a little girl who is having some very sweet, very warm things happening to her with a flower or anything else? If I see something and then it just suddenly came to my mind, I will say, yeah, let me do that. Sometimes other artists' artworks inspires me. Since I was always wondering when I see a wonderful piece, like how did they do that? This this part is sometimes for more to the technology or to some skills. It's boring to just to think about the technology. So I will start to fit in some story and then it start to grow to some piece that I really like. Sometimes I dream and there is some very fantastic stories that I never imagined when I am awake. The Masked Prince story, it's a very dark story. It's about uh, a prince who is cursed. Mm. It is not, not a story that we usually imagine because I'm one who is always drawn some cute girls, cute animals, rabbits. If it's personal work, then it's more about me exploring myself, exploring what is the limit of myself. It's what is the first thing that comes to me. If it's animation, then like the basic pipeline that we follow is um, keyframes, breakdowns, in between coloring, lighting, maybe more texture and after effects stuff. In the art world, I think there's no end to anything. You can always go deeper and deeper. You can always say to yourself, this is not perfect enough. For me, if this step is done, then it's done. I don't want to give more time to it. It's just, um, as long as I didn't figure out there's a huge issue in that piece, then for me, it's finished. I think it's a creative part um, and the fresh part because um, I'm the person who is always always like motivated by something unknown if if that's something that I never tried if there's something that I um, just knew to me then I'll just be super happy and excited to go for it and then explore how did these people do that or how did these people come to that idea how to create a story like this because like if it's only me then i'll never think of i'll never create a world like that the curiosity yeah the curiosity is the is a main point yeah <laughs>